what about him? Lincoln. Oh, it's hardly fair to drag him in. I don't believe he'd be prejudiced. Plato. How would you like to be defended by Plato? Nobody knew more about reasoning than Plato. If he's 81 when he died, he might be too old to think love important. Do you think so? Anyhow, Plato had very elementary ideas about love. Besides, didn't he quote Sophocles when somebody asked him if he was still able to appreciate a woman? What did the old boy say? Well, he said, uh, I'm only too glad to be rid of all that. It's like escaping from bondage to a raving madman. These Greeks. Call us their mark. Now, if he had been French. Richelieu, for example. Irresistible at it. How about Richelieu? I never liked him much in the Three Musketeers. Who do you want? You have only a few hours left. Look, it sounds a grand idea to have all these great men to choose from. But what do they know of our problems today? Two. They read it. Besides, I think it ought to be an Englishman. Nobody famous, but somebody with his head screwed on all right. Screwed? Now, this Abraham, um, Barton, Fowler. Was he a famous man? He was the first American to be killed by a British bullet. <laughs> no, I don't mean that. I mean, was he a great philosopher or statesman? He was a school teacher. There, you see. Now, Plato will probably talk about perceptions and causations. Pardon? Over your head, too? Definitely. That's quite simple. By the way, why are you so interested in my winning my case? Um? Yes, you. And why am I being taken up this stairway? I'm not being taken for a ride, am I, by any chance? What this suggestion? Take that bit of barley sugar away. I don't like it. I don't like your suggestions. I think I'll go back before it's too late. Peter. Peter, come back.